When building your website, it is important to position objects exactly in the places where you want them to be on each page. An object can be, for example, a text box, an image, a shape, or even a widget. When positioning an object, the same principles apply no matter what type of object you are placing on the page. How you position objects on your page does, however, depend on the type of page layout that you have chosen for the pages in your site. If you are using a responsive page layout, please check out our responsive website videos for more information on positioning objects. If you are using a centered or left aligned page layout, this video is for you. There are different ways in which you can position objects on your page. Usually, you just drag and drop an object to the position on the page where you want it. Sometimes, though, you might want to place the object in a specific location on the page, using its X and Y coordinates. To do this, first make sure that the object has been selected. Next, go to the Inspector window and click on the Metrics Inspector. Modify the horizontal X value and vertical Y value in the Position section by entering in the coordinates that you want to use. The object will move to the coordinates that you have entered. If you prefer, you can click on the up and down arrows to change the coordinate values. If you want to quickly align an object on the page, use Everweb's Alignment feature. For example, let's say you want this object to be centered on the page. First select the object, then use the Arrange Align Objects Center Menu option. As you can see, the object has moved to the center of the page. You can also use the Arrange Align menu to left align or right align the object on the page. Additionally, you can align the object to the top of the page, to the midpoint of the page, or to the bottom of the page. There may be times where you want to line up multiple objects with each other on the page. You could match up each object's coordinates on the page using the Metrics Inspector. To line up objects horizontally, make all the Y values the same for all of the objects. To line up objects vertically, make all the X values the same for all of the objects. If I want to have the objects equally spaced apart, I will have to work this out and position each object manually. There is, however, a much easier way to do all of this. In this example, I want to line up all of the objects along their top edges and have them equally spaced apart. Start by selecting all of the objects that you want lined up with each other. Once you have selected all of the objects, go to the Arrange Align Objects top menu. All of the objects will be aligned along their top edges. As the objects are still selected, I can also space them out evenly at the same time by using the Arrange Distribute Objects Horizontally menu option.